Hey everyone! So today we're doing a little review on these Da Vinci Pro Panels. Uh, these are the Ultra Smooth Gesso part, um, Panels. There, I did tape them off on the sides because I do want the wood look on the side. So when I varnish, um, we'll have the natural wood showing. So um, these are available on Jerry's Artorama. That link will be below this video. Check out Jerry's for all your paint pouring supplies. They have a lot of great stuff there. Um, we are using all of our paints are from Jerry's as well today. And let's get started. So I'm going to do three flip cups on here. Um, they're already sprayed with my WD-40 so I can release all the paint. We are going to be using Creative Inspirations Titanium White. Lucas Krill Acrylics, Indian Yellow. This is Creative Inspirations, Van Dyke Brown. This is Lucas Krill Acrylics, Turquoise. Lucas Gold Bronze Metallic. It's a beautiful color. And a little bit of Creative Inspirations Lamp Black. And I am going to put a little more of the paint in here because I'm really loving that Indian Yellow. A little white to separate it. We may pull a little gray there, but we'll be careful. Indian Summer is beautiful. We won't need this much paint, but I want enough paint so I can play. <laughs> Van Dyke Brown. Beautiful turquoise from Lucas. It's the perfect color. Of course, that bronze from Lucas, gold bronze. And just a touch of black. Okay. So I'm just going to go ahead and flip these over. So I'll give you another look at this. I already see this white here that I'm not going to like. So I'm going to push that paint towards it so we'll be able to dump it off. The Indian Yellow really showed up and it's absolutely gorgeous. I'm going to pull this back out of the glare. Let's give it just a little torch and see what happens. Got a lot of little ones coming up. All right, so let's start tilting. I just want to move it around a little bit and open that up. Okay, I don't want to lose too much of this here, so I am going to cup that edge to keep that. I don't have a lot going on here, but I see cells underneath that I think we'll be able to bring up. I'm really loving that middle section. And if you notice when I'm tilting, I always bring the paint back to the middle. So when I'm heading somewhere else, I have everything flowing together. I'm actually kind of liking that white there now, so I am going to leave it. I'm 
just balancing. Okay, let me wet my hand and we will start torching that area there. Uh, the yellow is coming up. I like the black in there too. I didn't think I was going to, but I do. Okay. One lone caterpillar that is dissolving because the yellow is coming up through. <laughs> We will get more um, action on that. So we may um, pause this video and come back and see what happens. Because the white's going to continue to sink a little bit. So. so I'm going to turn it this way. I'm going to take a quick break. We'll come back in five minutes and see what it looks like, but for you, it'll be a few seconds. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. I uh, did get some more cells coming through. They're little turquoise ones. They're cute. And a little bit came through on that white. I will give you a close-up. interesting. I'm really um, liking the way that that's coming through. It will continue to change as it dries. So that's going to be it for that. Um, these panels are wonderful, especially if you're going to be doing resin. When this is completely dry, um, I will clean the painting next and make sure I get all the silicone off. Then I'll remove the tape and then I'll do my resin coat. So if you haven't tried these Da Vinci boards from Jerry's, um, they are on sale. Now's the time to get them. So um, try them out. I'm sure you'll love them. Um, I like these a lot for acrylic pouring. Once in a while, if you get too much paint on there, um, they will heave up, but they do settle back down as they're drying. So don't freak out. Um, they will be flat when they're dry. So that'll be it for that one, guys. Subscribe if you haven't. Click on that bell for notifications. Click like and share. Leave a comment for me, please. And check out Jerry's for all your paint supplies. Uh, the Lucas, the Creative Inspirations, the Soho, the Grumbacher. I recommend them all, and Jerry's carries them all. And they run sales all the time, so you'll be able to get them at great prices. It's very good paint, uh, very high quality pigment, and you just can't beat the prices. So check out Jerry's, and also check out um, our Etsy shop where you can find our paintings for sale. And if you have any questions, you can reach me at ChristinaWelchArt at Yahoo.com. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you all on the next one. Bye now.